Yo, what is up, YouTube? What's up with everybody? So, where I am a little too late to the party, you know what I'm saying, with this, how LeBron was in like, I mean, this game six just happened. You feel me? Game six just happened. Um, the Lakers went. So, not just happened yesterday, last night. You know what I mean? So, I know I'm late, but fuck it, just watching anyway. You know, still can have good laughs. I do want to see it, though, because I want to see what, you know, you know what they did with the game up with. You, you know what I'm saying? You know, a lot of people, you know, like, um, Marcus Morris didn't get a lot of blame. Hey, man, I just got it. See, the only thing, I'm not, I was never really mad at Danny Green because everybody missed. Like, I didn't see Klay Thompson and Stephen Curry miss wide open threes. So, so I seen some of the best shooters in the, uh, in the NBA in the world miss wide open threes. You feel me? Not even in the game, in practice and shit. Like, you can't make every shot. You see what I'm saying? So, I wasn't mad at him because you can't make every shot. You feel me? Nobody shoot a hundred percent from the field. Uncontested. <laughs> and he doing Marcus Morris too. That's what I was just talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know what I was thinking? Like, these dudes live in this big-ass house together. That don't probably lit. That shit probably feel like niggas in school. You know what I'm saying? Like, you chill with your homeboys every day. I probably on all kids' vibes and shit. That's how it is being a street nigga for real, for real. But the difference is, y'all be, like, on different type of times. We don't all live together. You know what I'm saying? Street niggas don't live together like this. But like it is like it is like a school vibe though where like you know you with your niggas and y'all laughing and joking, just like that shit used to be sitting in the classroom at dusk. Well, that's how shit was for me. I don't know about y'all. We wasn't really we did work, but you know we was chilling too. You feel me? You have to be putting your hands on me any type of way. You got to see me real shit. That's <laughs> some, some shit that's some shit to do, you know. He, he from Philly, you know what I'm saying? So You know everybody else who been coming to the locker room. Cool, so everybody that was hooping, that's three points. I don't know why you living there, you still playing. <laughs> You're playing next game. Uh LeBron, about AD, we haven't checked him out, so I mean we don't know if he's gonna be able to play next game. Did I say something to you? You know, I, I remember that law so vividly, Game 5. I remember LeBron walking in the locker room and LeBron, AD was behind him and shit. I remember this law. What's wrong with you? I'm not playing with you. What's your name? Tell You ain't a Caruso. You better be open. Can you? What you mean you feel like that they are king who gets the Yeah. Okay, we're gonna see next game then. Now if I gotta go to a game set with the heat, don't know y'all gotta worry about your rings. <laughs> Alright man, uh pretty good vid by uh the squad RDC World One. Check them out if you guys haven't. They make pretty fun videos. I am subscribed to them myself. Pretty funny videos. They also got an Instagram channel, I think. I mean Instagram page where they post uh funny shit like this. So check them out there. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. I'm out. Thanks for watching and I'm gonna end this video here. Peace.